Looks like okay. we are going to be seeing the Azir. Yeah, Fly will be taking the Azir to the mid lane, and so there's our roster. KT in a situation where they've got similar comps, but uh, they may just kind of lose lane to everybody on Rock's Tigers. Rock's Tigers get that. The dragon is filled with spears. Oh, there's Mop. There we go. Praise like, why aren't you smiting this? <laughs> Callista has no AoE wave clear until she gets the Hurricane, so really not much they can do. Yep. Uh, not going to pray. They're going to go in, score, trying to repel away. Gorilla getting a little bit low. They may dive this. No, not quite. Teleport brings Smeb down as well as someday. To set up a gank onto Smeb in the top lane. Peanut is there, as is Gorilla, but Smeb on his own for so long. He's tanky Nautilus, so he's going to alt score. Score takes some damage. Chani throws up the shield for some blocking. Smeb getting even lower in first blood, taken by Someday. Now Gorilla and Peanut on their own. Kindred all used. Someday didn't lose a whole lot of health, though. Here comes Kuro to finish off Someday. Probably going to get it. Yep, there's the kill for LeBlanc. And now Fly a little bit late to that party. Really rare mechanical mistake from Peanut. He actually used his ult too late to keep Smeb alive. Smeb yeah. just dies at the start of the fight. The trust between these players. Oh, oh hello. Wow. Girl got caught. Trying to get away now. I don't know. Nope, not quite enough. Yeah, I was going to say. Over-aggression from the Rock oh, Tigers. Oh, Kuro. Space checks a brush. Space checking a brush against Elise and Brahm. Yep, not a great idea. The pick power it's of... I don't know. I don't know why you do that. <laughs> ah, keep me a topical. Your national bird. <laughs> right. Oh, grow. Uh, just trying to grass fly a little bit as KT takes the dragon, and they've been warding on their way too. So they've been slowly sort of taking control of the bottom side, and that mid turret is ready to fall. Machani comes from the side. Nice Brahm ultimate. Really good one. Locks up three people. Gorilla pops his ult again. They're gonna turn this back around. Sivir all used as Gorilla goes into the back lines, pulled out with Fate's call. Are they gonna throw back in again? No going to back away and KT appropriately content to take that mid lane turret. Yeah, not bad. Oh, Peanut finds score, but Arrow's right there too. Peanut needs to get out of here. Kuro running away. Here comes the teleport for KT. Someday all over that LeBlanc. Peanut on the wrong, uses that Lamb's respite to let Gorilla come in. Oh, but it doesn't help. Arrow takes him out as soon as he steps off of it. Kuro and Prey right there. Someday diving deep. Kuro has to flash. They're going to turn it around onto Maokai. There's a kill for Kuro. Meanwhile, the minions do take out the Disc of the Sun in the mid lane. It's not a lot. No, not much. Run! Score. Coming in, they force a flash. Ah, the Cocoon is ready, though. Smep could be in a bit of trouble. Yeah, and when I say a bit of trouble, a lot. Nice anchor, tries to get away, trying to get back to some of his teammates, but nobody's really around. So the Great Nautilus chase ends with another kill for someday. Gorilla. And the rest of the Rocks Tigers are sacrificing their top laner for a dragon. And from the farm numbers, if you look at the difference, I believe Rocks Tigers have actually found 50 cents more. Oh, Whoa, boy. Gorilla with the engage. Fly in trouble. Headbutt used, but Fly pushes people out with the Emperor's Divide. Still gets knocked up in the end there by Smeb's ultimate. Everybody low. Lambs are spite trying to get that heal off. There we go. KT chasing Rocks Tigers back down the mid lane, though. Uh -oh. Prime for a uh -oh. face check. Gorilla right there, they're gonna jump right onto him. They know Alsar has no ult, they blow him up immediately. And now KT on the run. Nice TP from Someday, comes in from behind, helps him lock up Kindred, a kill onto Peanut. And KT rolls are gonna go right over that Baron. Just a perfect wow. use of taking down the outer mid lane turret early, allowed them to push up Vision. Beautiful teleport flank from Maokai. Well, this now Rock is, Tigers, what are they gonna do? This is a, a really tight KT rollster team so far in this game. You just never know what to expect from KT. Sometimes so. you see this KT, sometimes you see the Protect the Draven. How can they look clueless about the meta then completely on top of it? KT putting some pressure on this tier two in mid lane. And the teleport coming in from behind. Rox Tigers are gonna try to fight this. Gorilla goes in really early. Here comes the ult from Smab, gonna knock up Fly. They're gonna try to get back onto a prey, getting a lot of nice auto attacks in. But Rox Tigers have to back away. A kill for Arrow already. And KT with the edge in this fight. There go the Sand Soldiers. A kill for Hachani and KT crushing this fight. A triple kill for Arrow, and they're gonna at least get an inhibitor. This may be the game with the Baron buff. What do I you was think? Optimistic to go for a teleport flank against yeah. a team with Baron, especially with Azir, Braum, Maokai, uh -oh. so much disengage. They're gonna look for the win. Yeah, Peanut doing what he can, but he is a 1v5 right now as KT runs in for the win at sub 25 minutes. Goodbye, Peanut. You're Peanut Butter now. <laughs> KT should be able to finish off the second Nexus turret, and then the Nexus Gorilla trying to beat the support hero that we all know he is, but right now 
It is all KT Rolster, a dominating game number one. GG. To say it's dominating, it's a 25-minute yeah. win over the Rocks Tigers. We have not seen the likes of a game like this all season.